What are you doing? Help! Guards! Save your breath. No one is coming to help you. Now what am I going to do with you? You little thief! What else have you taken out with it? Please, sir. It was just an apple. I'm hungry. With sticky fingers like yours, I wouldn't be surprised to find more stolen goods under those petticoats. If more beggars steal Don't worry. I scared the guard off. Oh. Thank you, Mom. Do you live up in the castle? No. I don't live anywhere, Mom. My mother died this spring. Run away then, little girl. Run and hide. Go away! Shoo! No, thank you. I'd rather come with you, please. You really need to run off now. Where are we going? None of your business, brat. Just be glad I saved you and that you live another day. Please let me come with you. I'm cold and I've nowhere to go. I promise I'll be good. But I'm... Not. Just leave. You can't stop me from following you. <sighs> if I bring you along, will you do exactly what I tell you to do? Yes, Mom. My name is Lily. <clears throat> Are we headed towards your home? No, we're not going home. Do you know any stories? I love stories. No. I'm hungry. Is there food? No. Do you think we might find food? Maybe. I like apples. We had an apple tree. Then it died. I like hazelnuts. Mm, they're nice too. It's so lovely to talk to someone nice. I haven't met anyone nice in ages. Thank you, Mom. You're welcome, Lily. What's your name? It's not important. You seem awfully tired. It's been a trying time for me. What happened to your parents? Kingsman took my father to work in the quarry, but that was a long time ago. And my mother? She died this spring. Died? That's been going around. How do you get by? Oh, I... I, f I find things. Food and shelter. It was easy in the summer, but... But it's not summer anymore. I miss my mother. She was kind and gentle. I think my father was too. I'm not sure. I, I can't remember. I hope I can grow up to be just like mother. In this awful world, you want to be kind and gentle. She used to say, the gentlest people are the strongest. And in her stories, the kind and gentle ones always win the day. She told me a lot of stories. Wonderful stories. But they didn't help her save herself. I guess so. Where do you live? I used to live in a house. Some people moved in after Mother died, and they told me I had to go. That's not fair, is it? No, I don't suppose it is. I was thinking, people die every day. They certainly do. And you think my mother died because she's too nice. But I think good and bad people both die, and there's nothing they can do about it. But good people will have a better life before they die, so it makes sense to be good. So who are good people, and who are bad people? Well, you know, in stories, good people go out of their way to help others, and bad people are greedy and selfish, and try to kill their fathers or stepdaughters. So, what do you think about bad people, the greedy killers? I try to avoid them. 
Mother said, evil habits catch on and drag your soul down to hell. She was probably right. Ooh, is it still a long way to go? A little longer, little Lily. We're deep in the castle. It's almost dawn. Won't it be terribly dangerous when the morning comes? We'll be seen. We'll sort it out when we get there. One problem at a time. Ah, oh, did you hear Lords Joyce and Maddock are stirring up trouble again? This land can't afford another war. I pray to the heavens that we might keep this king. I haven't seen a season of peace in my life. <laughs> yeah, now there's a thought. If the king were to die, I don't know, say, well, he ate a bad fish. It'd be the same war, but worse, and just with Joyce and Maddock fighting for the crown. So I pray every night that the king keeps his crown and his life for years to come. I could do with a bit of peace. Well, that sounds a little inconvenient. You're not going to harm the king, are you? I'll spare him tonight. What are you doing? Help! Guards! Save your breath. No one is coming to help you. As you can see, I'm not dead yet, despite your best efforts. If you're here to kill me, then kill me. Tonight I'm only here for my payment, your majesty. Not for your blood. Much good it'll do you. <laughs> because you'll come after me again. I was thinking of taking a little head start. <clears throat> now what am I going to do with you? This is where we part. Run off, Lily. Run far away. Try and find a corner of this world where you can feel safe. Oh, please. Can't I come with you? With death on my heels? I don't think so. What if I just follow you? And have your soul dragged down to hell? You wouldn't do that. Time is running out. The king will have his guards on us soon enough. But thank you for being a friend. I don't think I've ever had one before. Goodbye now. Goodbye.